What's up, everybody? It's Lindsay, your favorite fly girl. Your only fly girl, really. Hopefully, I'm your favorite one, too. <laughs> um, and here we are, episode five of our amazing Backstage at Wicked series. Uh, get ready for some fun, fun, fun stuff. Miss Catherine. Yes. Oh, hi. Say hi, Broadway.com. Oh, hi, Broadway.com. This is Catherine Charlebaugh. She plays Nessa Rose. That's me. My sister. <laughs> Kevin, how long have you been playing Nessa? Oh God, for probably like a year and a half now. I played it wow. for 10 months on the road with mm -hmm. one of the tours, and then I've been doing it since the beginning of December here. And what's your favorite part about playing Nessa? Oh God, um, <laughs> it's not sitting in that chair, I'll tell you that much. That's right, common misconception that her job is easy because she sits easy. in that chair. First tell of them all, how I hard have that super duper guns. <laughs> So much. Oh, we can we see and those guys. Yes. <laughs> yes. And um, it's the stage is on a slope, so when I have to push myself up and down it, I really have to have a lot of control. So it does a wonder on your back and your shoulders. Right. But um, yeah, that's not so fun. But I, I love playing Nessa. It's so fun to get to be um, really fun and excited in the first act, and then in the second act, you get to be really nasty and evil. Yes. And I like doing that too. <laughs> I don't usually get to play nasty people, so it's really fun. You're hysterical. <laughs> Okay, you guys, this is a very special day because <laughs> our amazing Glinda standby, Miss Tiffany Haas, is going on as Glinda. And we get to have her for the next couple days while Katie Rose is gone, and she's amazing. And everyone meet her and say hi. Hi. Hi, Tiff. And so, so tell them what your job is like. Like, go through your average, like your day when you don't go on. Like, what do you do? Oh, yeah. Well, I have projects upstairs. Mm -hmm. So you just come in a half hour mm -hmm. and sign in. Yes. And you share a dressing room with, with Donna, Donna Levino, who's the Alpha standby. standby but so you guys just, um, how long do you have to be in the building? We are able to leave after intermission. So we're in the building for Act 1 and not for Act So basically that means that like in Act 2, if something happens, then what, they'll throw the understudy on? Yes. And I think depending on how close we are in a radius to the theater. Right. We... You know, then they could call us, I guess, and we could come back. But yeah, that's why we also have understudies in the show who understudy. But the standby is the person who always goes on for Alphabet or Glinda first. Mm -hmm. We are ready for action. That's right. And your only job is to be here and go on. It's a standby. Mm -hmm. When Katie or I are not here. Yeah. And sometimes Donna and I will watch the show. Uh -huh. um, sometimes we'll do a workout video. <laughs> how, yeah. often, how often do you guys rehearse? Um, sometimes we rehearse during the show if everything is okay downstairs. Like when um, me and Derek were being put in. Yes! Oh my gosh, what a perfect example to talk about. That's how I got to know Lindsay and Derek. Um, because when they were first being brought into the show, we would be upstairs in the rehearsal room during the show. Mm -hmm. And um, I would go, since Katie was here and, and doing the show, I would just go upstairs and be their Glinda. Yeah. And it was so fun. It was so awesome. It was amazing. <laughs> And you love the crowns. Oh, yeah. Oh. Is that your favorite part of yes. Glinda? All right, so let's go. I've definitely done many of these moments in my <laughs> regular hair. Let's see. I've been like, oh. just like in here, like. Just by yourself having a moment. Yeah, like opening my new powder and stuff. Uh-huh, <laughs> and just feeling like you need to live, right? Yeah, and like, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited to go on with you tonight. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. That was so fun the first time we went on together. It was, it was. And it's awesome because we we get to go on a lot with each other. It's, it's, it's so cool. Yeah, it's so cool. Hey guys, so uh, a couple weeks ago we were talking about the fight call. And today is a very special day because Tiffany Haas, our Glinda standby, is going on for Katie Rose, who's not in the show tonight. So Tiffany and I are going to do fight call and we're going to let you see how we do it. You'll see. Too, Here so she comes. Thanks, Colby. Oh. Hi. Say hi, Broadway.com. Hi, Broadway.com. There's Tiffany and hi. John and Colby. Oh, you little sneak, <laughs> sneak <laughs> <little sneak. laughs> It's amazing. So how John's our dance captain, around. and Colby uh, lifts up right. Tiffany in this scene. And Tiffany oh. just had her appendix out a week ago. Wow, what a warrior she is. She's I back in the show and doing the show tonight. She's amazing. Maybe I'll look smaller. So we're make this <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> uh, he never belonged here. He 
doesn't love you and he never did. He loves me. <laughs> Feel better? Yes, I do. Good. So do I. Okay, so we're now in the depths of the Gershwin Theater and we are in the women's ensemble dressing room. I'm gonna take you guys back to meet the amazing women that are in our show. <gasps> Starting with Brianna. Hi, say hi Broadway.com. Hi Broadway.com. What are you doing? I am doing math at the moment. I put my burrito in for the long wrong amount of time. So it was supposed to be four and a half minutes. I put it in for four minutes oh. minus 15 seconds. It's complicated. Oh my gosh, I that's making my mind just explode. I'm just gonna do four minutes. Here's Betsy. Say hi hey. Broadway.com. What's going on? Woo. Betsy plays Shen Chen among many other great roles in this show. <laughs> Betsy, how long have you been here at uh, the Wicked? I've been in the Broadway company for two years, and I was on tour with it. And love in every minute. And bought an apartment. hey -o! <laughs> We love that. Here's Lindsay. Oh, hey, just Say hi. Like that, from, <laughs> Lindsay, what is your track in the show? I am filling in for an onstage swing. Cool. What does that mean? So that means I know all ten of the ladies' parts in here. Did you hear that? She knows all ten of the parts. That is crazy. And only occasionally lose my mind. But, you know, it happens. Um, that is so cool. But I still get to do the show every night and do at least a couple numbers if I'm not on for one of these people. That's so awesome. Fun. Keeps it exciting. Here's Miss Carla. Hi, Hi Carla. And what track are you, Carla? I um, I understudy you. Yes, she is the Elfie understudy. It's really fun. And then you know I uh, I I'm in the ensemble and I get to rock out some badass horns. Yes. I said ass. Ooh, I said it's all right. Again. That's <laughs> really it's really fine. We're cool. <laughs> this is a theater blog. And there's Tess. Say hi Broadway.com. Hi Broadway.com. And Tess, what about you? What is your job here? I'm a Universal swing. What does that mean? So like that Universal means, Studios or? That's like Universal Studios. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, I am I'm basically a member of all three companies in North America. Wow. So I cover the singers in both tours and on the Broadway company. Wow. And the Nessas. And all so you know so many parts. I know 19 parts. That is insane. What's going on? Hi. Tell me, tell everyone what your track is. Um, I am what they call the palm tree track. It's a dancer track. Okay. And most of the time her hair is sticking straight up on top of her head, which is not hard for me. I was going to say, I'm kind of seeing... I'm halfway there already. Okay, you're getting there. Well, you're getting there. You're getting there. Well, hello. Say hi, Broadway.com. Hi, Broadway.com. So this is Kristen. How long? Okay, what track are you? I play the mother. Who's mother? I'm your mother. Oh, I'm the mother. <laughs> okay. And I'm a dancer in the ensemble, so I play lots of different roles. Oh in the show. my gosh! And how yes. long have you been here? I'm an original company member. Did you hear that? Re OC. 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 Yes. In this case, what's your track? I am a dancer in the ensemble, and I'm also a monkey. <gasps> okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh! What's okay? Fill fill us in about the monkeys. People want to know about the monkeys. What's it like? They really do. People tweet People asking about them. about the monkeys. How how hard is it to be a monkey? What is that oh. costume? What's happening? That, the Thirty plus. Are monkey. you guys breaking? Is the costume? Is the mask heavy? Are the wings heavy? The wings are heavy. Yeah. They are. A little bit, yeah. And do you all fly? Like actually fly? How many of you get to fly, really? All the girls fly at some point. All the girls fly. But it's both men and women are monkeys. Yes. Okay. Yes. Hi, what's up? Oh, hi, Maya. Hi, Broadway.com. All right, now go ahead. Go ahead and share. My name is Maya Awari Griffin, married name Shulman. Okay. I've been with the Broadway company since March of 09. So wow. It's a very long time. Amazing. Um, I do have a baby. <gasps> She's pretty awesome. Come on. Look at that. Sammy. Gorgeous. Um, 
and I play, I'm in the ensemble, a dancer track. Mm -hmm. I play one of Glinda's best friends, yes, so I get to so hate you a lot. So mean. Um, and I love it here. I really do. It. It's a job, but I, it's the best job I could have ever do. That's an awesome. And Miss Heather. What's going on? Tell everyone, tell everyone what you do in the show. I am Dorothy. Yes. And I am a, a, an ensemble. Yes. And so I get to play all the characters. You got a lot going on. Yeah. Um, got a lot going on. Yeah. All right. Have a good show. You guys have a good show, everybody. Okay. Bye. Hey, Broadway.com. Um, I'm stealing the camera for a little bit while. Lindsay and the rest of the company finish up the first act. I'm done with the first act, so this is kind of my intermission break. And I thought I'd show you a little, let's show you around a little bit. So we're walking down the principal hallway right now. And uh, I'm going to show you guys something cool kind of in the staircase um, that I don't think Lindsay showed you guys yet. Um, but in here, there is a huge mural that Eddie in our cast actually drew. He painted all of this. There's Glenda down there with the dragon. And it goes up the staircases to all the dressing rooms, which is really cool. And every, everybody is like character specific, which is really cool. And then up at the top of the stairs is Alphaba, the very top, which is kind of cool. And it goes all the way up about two and a half floors, which is cool. And then there is a Citizens of Oz wall. When you leave the show, you write a little something on the wall. So everyone that's, you know, been a part of the production is on this wall, which is pretty cool. Now we've reached Dr. Dilliman's and Box dressing room, John and Michael. Let's see what they're up to at the end of Act 1. Oh. Oh, what's up? What's up, Mike? Hey, what's up? How hey, you doing, are you? dude? What are you yeah, doing? Good. Just, Just watching, some, watching some TV? Yeah, house. Oh, that's, a, that's a very nice robe you got. Thanks. And um, what are those? Are those tights? And, oh, yeah, and high heels. Show. Yeah, I wear, I wear uh, all the tights. Obviously, Mike is just relaxing. What um, this is his. Oh, say so hi to. This is Broadway.com. Hi, hi, Broadway.com. Yeah, are you? yeah. I just awesome. thought I'd come in and see where you're up to. I had and... no idea you were going to come by. That's really weird. Yeah. Hi, all. So we're at intermission, and the insanely handsome gentleman that is beating my face is none other than the gorgeous, the handsome, the debonair, the fiercest, Rob Harmon. Say hi, Rob. Hey, Rob. Oh, God. So, Rob uh, fills in for Craig when he's not here. And Craig is gone, you know, every so often. Right, Rob? Rob's been, this is, what, our, like, seventh show in a row together? Yeah. So, Rob gives a fierce beat. We love him. And we have fun in here. Thank you. Mm -hmm. um, so, I'm going to answer a couple of your questions uh, for this week. Ready? Right? All right. Dr. Matt asks, Lindsay Mendez, in videos, you and your castmates seem very casual five minutes before going on. Do you get nervous anymore? Okay. I can't speak for my castmates. I can say that I'm pretty calm, um, and right before I'm about to run out through the clock face, I, I get little butterflies probably every night. Um, that's natural, but as soon as I get out there, I'm okay. Um, but definitely, I still get you know, excited for the show to happen no matter how many times I've done it. It's, um, I think that's natural and that's part of it. But once that happens, I'm never nervous again. It's usually my only time to be nervous. E Send W, aka Sarah Walker, asks, What is the funniest thing that happened to you on or off stage at Wicked? It happened to me just, just a few minutes today. ago. Moments <laughs> ago. I ran out from my first entrance and slipped, well, majorly slipped, and almost fell into the orchestra pit. My very first entrance on stage. It was scary and really funny. And then I tried to recover. And I, d I mean, I think I recovered, and I, but places, I was just... Places, everyone, places, places, please, places. I was um, definitely smiling hard. Luckily, I'm supposed to be excited to be at Shiz because I was dying laughing at myself slipping it was pretty hysterical <laughs> this is dylan a Connolly, and he asks lindsey mendez does the green makeup and black lipstick ever rub off on Derek klenna rob can answer that because rob has a cue 
right before that, right? I do. I put a nice later layer of powder on both of them to help prevent slippage and runneth off. <laughs> and then the second they come off stage, I am there waiting to touch them up. To, de to, to touch up the green. Usually, to touch up the green, and I stand there with a makeup wipe also to wipe any lipstick that may have rubbed off. And does Derek. he? Does Derek have a lot on him? Um, more than he should probably. Whoops! <laughs> Sorry about it. Oh, look! Speak of the devil, Derek. One of our Twitter questions this week was: yes. Do you get green and black on you after our scene together? Oh, do I? I <laughs> said you don't get that much. I'll steal the camera again later, and I'll show you how much green I have on when I wash. Don't it off. you dare! I will. I'm gonna do it. No, it's some, sometimes it's better than others, but I definitely do get a lot of green on when I when I wash it off with soap. All the soap is just green. That was a good question and answer, team. All right, Broadway.com. That's it for this week. Tune in next week to our next episode where I will be taking you on a very fun Alphaba field trip. I can't wait. See you guys then. Oh, and tweet me your questions uh, at Lindsay Mendez hashtag Fly Girl. Can't wait to hear from you and see you next week. Bye. With you. Never bring us down